Good morning. I'm Dr. Jimenez, the proud principal of Newman Smith High School, where our mission is to graduate all scholars to be college, career, or military ready without remediation. Please join me for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now join me for our pledge to the Texas flag. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee. Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. And now for our moment of silence. Thank you. Good morning, Newman Smith. I'm Dr. Jimenez, the proud principal of Newman Smith High School, where our mission is to graduate all scholars to be college, career, or military ready without remediation. It is Wednesday, and we are super excited to have you here at school today. We hope that this week you will start to find your rhythm as a scholar, get that work turned in and be focused on getting those credits toward graduation. Well, we have a very special guest on our news today, but before we introduce her, I'd like to make a few announcements, just a little bit of administrivia. Don't forget that Absence Makeup starts this week. It was yesterday, Tuesday, and Thursday. We will send you more information via our student square, so be on the lookout in your email for that information. Don't forget from our district, September is Attendance Awareness Month. Join us in recognizing the importance of good school attendance by participating in the following Spirit Days each week. Week 1, September 7th through the 10th. Shine bright at school, week two, selfies at school, week three, make a pledge, and week four, crazy for school. And they are asking that you send those pictures to CFB and tag it, get your selfie to school. I love that. Hashtag, get your selfie to school. Because remember, our credits are made up of two things, attendance and graduation. We have lots of fun dress-up days here at Smith as well. September the 10th, that's this Friday, we're going to have red, white, and blue day so that we can honor September 11th. And what happened many years ago, I was teaching in this building on September 11th, and Mr. Pouncey came on the news on PA, and we all turned on our television, and we watched that terrible, terrible tragedy with our scholars that happened on September the 11th. And we want to um, honor those that died by wearing our red, white, and blue this Friday on September 10th, since September 11th is a Saturday. All right, well, our SAT word of the day is altercation. Altercation is a noun. It is a noisy argument or confrontation. Don't get in an altercation at school because Dr. J will send you away. Well, you know what I mean. Trojans uphold those five pillars. No altercations on this campus. They do not come with a fun consequence. So let's keep our school peaceful and our hallways nice. Well, our very special guest today, I actually really like this scholar. She's so smart. She's really amazing. She's fun to visit with. She is, I think I just like to call her Madam President, but she is the co-president of the Interact, and she is the president of DECA. She's involved in orchestra and IBA. Let's welcome to our news today, Kelly Pham. Hi, guys. I'm Kelly. I'm a senior, and first off, I just wanted to say I really like Smith for the teachers. It's not just about teaching things or the subjects, but it's also about the large life lessons I'm gonna be able to use outside of college and in college, and just in general to become a better person. So I thank my teachers for that. Awesome, Kelly, tell us a little bit about Interact. You know, I actually love the Rotary. I'm a Rotary member, and uh, Interact is the junior club for Rotary. So tell us about what the Interact does here at Smith. Yeah, so I'm the co-president of Interact, and then my co-president, Stephanie Baldrama, couldn't make it today. But what it is, it's a community service club, and one of our most recent projects was donating 1,200 backpacks to CFB elementary schools and middle schools this summer. So if you want to join a club like that, 
and kind of participate in projects like that, our first meeting is going to be today, September 8th at 8 a.m. and 3.50 p.m. And then where it is, it's the IBA Entrepreneurship and Incubator Room. And you can just look for a sign NE155 and it's the room left of that. Awesome. Well, Kelly, when you came in to do the news this morning, you mentioned, you said, Dr. J, I have a book recommendation for you. Can you <laughs> tell me what that book recommendation is? Yes. So it's called Extreme Ownership by Jocko Willing and Leif Babin, How U.S. Navy Seals Lead and Win. And it's definitely a leadership book, but what I've really learned from it so far is how to deal with failure and hardships in life. We can't let successes and failures define us. What we can do is just learn from those hardships and move on and just become a better person from those lessons we've learned from those failures. Well, and Kelly, it was ironic that you had listed that book. I'm a huge Jocko Willink fan, and I think that he has a lot to offer in the arena of leadership. He's a pretty amazing guy. You guys should look him up on yeah. the internet. I think he gets up at 4 a.m. and does this crazy, crazy workout schedule. Um, but moreover, it's his wisdom about leadership that has really helped me in the several of his books. I think he even has a children's book out. He's pretty amazing. Yeah. Well, Kelly, awesome. Thank you so much for being on our news here. We'll close out together. All right, Trojans, we love you. We think you're great. Remember, character counts and make it a great day or not. The, the choice, choice is, is yours. yours.